9 starts now. An Oklahoma City police officer hurt after his patrol car was slammed into by a Metro mom who admitted to driving while intoxicated. This is a follow up to a story we told you about yesterday right near Southeast 29th and the I-35 service road. News 9 crime tracker Jennifer Pierce has new details now from the investigation. Court documents show this was the driver's second DUI arrest in 10 years, making this one a felony charge. Investigators say 33 year old Lavenda Smith was driving at a high rate of speed when she slammed into the back of an Oklahoma City officer's patrol car. The officer was stopped at the intersection of Southeast 29th and the I 35 service road right next to a Sonic where employees heard the crash. It was like a big explosion. It sounded like an explosion. Boom, like real loud like that. Police and IMSA responded to the injury crash. Oklahoma Highway Patrol troopers were called to the scene to investigate Smith, who appeared to be under the influence. One of the DREs is what we call them, drug recognition expert. One of the DREs actually made the arrest and then the other one did the eval separate from the arrest at the hospital. OHP's arrest affidavit stated Smith told troopers she was upset after a phone call with her boyfriend and was on the way to pick up her children, but did not say where she was coming from. They noticed uh, several indicators of intoxicants. Uh, there were also uh, uh, statements by the suspect that there was intoxicants in the blood. Smith admitted to troopers she took three shots of alcohol before the crash and smoked marijuana earlier in the day. Troopers also learned Smith was convicted of DUI in 2015 in Colorado. This time, Smith was booked into the Oklahoma County Detention Center for DUI. Smith and the officer were taken to local hospitals to be treated for their injuries. Both are expected to be okay. In Northeast Oklahoma City, Jennifer Pierce, Oklahoma's own News 9.